Hey guys, it is an impromptu giveaway today, marking my one year anniversary on YouTube. I've made up my mind that's the occasion. The real reason is because the giveaway box is getting quite full. So here we go. We are going to do a giveaway. Be sure and stick around to the end because there's going to be rules for how you enter this. And Ruger and I, oh, there he is. He just showed up. Ruger, show your face. Ruger and I are going to have some fun showing you the terrific, really terrific variety of things in this box. Okay, let's get into it. Well, hey, welcome to a rather impromptu giveaway box. I know I've been talking about my giveaway box for a while. It's been filling up with things. It's still not all the way full, so I may add a thing or two before I actually ship this out to the winner. But trust me, there's plenty of value in here without doing that. There's some really fun things that I have been collecting. Everything in here, I think, almost everything except for one thing I'm looking at, I actually paid for the box that it came in. So. I'm not trying to make anybody feel bad. I'm just letting you know. These, these are things I actually thought it would, they were worthy of purchasing to show you guys. Um, get it, yourself a cold beverage of choice. As I say, this could get a little bit lengthy. I tend to visit in, um, in videos like this where I'm not as organized as I normally am in my videos. But I want to show you guys what's in here. The rules for entering this are going to be a little bit different. So one thing you will do on this video is I want you to tell me below why you would like to win this box. Um, and you have to be, of course, subscribed. I need for you to like the video and um, then that will quick also, you know, you'll have to comment down below. That really helps. I'll have another rule coming up and it's a little bit different. So you want to be sure and watch and we will choose. Sam and I will choose uh, one, one winner to be sent this box. Like I said, something else could get thrown in here as time goes on. And let's see, I'm recording this on Tuesday the 18th. It's my oldest daughter's birthday. It's her 34th birthday. Not that that matters. Told you, I visit during these. And we're gonna try and get this video on Wednesday. Be sure and watch tomorrow because we have another clothing unboxing coming up tomorrow. That one is going to be, I can't remember which one it is, but there's a clothing video that's coming up tomorrow. It might be Drape Fit. Um, and then um, we'll go ahead and I will choose the winner. I'll choose the winner on Saturday. And then you'll have three days to get back to me uh, with an email. And then if I haven't found anybody by the following Tuesday, then I, a week from today, then I will go ahead and find a new winner. Okay. Now that we've got that little bit of housekeeping out of the way, let's go ahead and talk about what is in this box. And as I list, I will try and remember to link the boxes I talk about that things came from in the drop down box. And if you want to do something just to help me out and help the channel out, watch those videos. Um, the algorithm still doesn't know quite what to do with those, I don't think. And I think it's really kind of slowed down our growth. And I think if those videos could get watched, it won't cost you anything. You just want to watch them while you um, are doing housework. I, a lot of times that's how I do it. I'm cooking, I'm doing housework, I have other things going on and I'll just look over every once in a while and see what my favorite YouTubers are talking about in their videos because I know it helps their, their channels. Um, if you would watch those for me, that would really, really help us out a lot. We've been a little bit frustrated with growth, but I do think it has something to do with me doing different types of videos other than clothing. And I do understand that my viewers like to watch clothing because that's what I started out doing, but I want to do all kinds of unboxings. It just keeps my brain engaged. Okay, now let's finally get into items in here. We have got three face masks. And you're going to think I'm crazy for letting some of these things go, but it's just that they won't work for me for different reasons. So two of them, um, the Illuminating Honey Essence Mask. This is purifying, clarifying, soothing, moisturizing, brightening, and nourishing. That's a lot in one mask. And the Gold Essence Mask. This is for elasticity and nutrition. These both came in my Introverted Chick uh, box. And I tend to have sensitive skin and I don't want to take a chance. Plus masks require holding still for about 10 or more minutes. Not something I'm good at. And then also there is the Get Dewy With It Mega Moisture Sheet Mask. I honestly don't remember where this one came from. But if you, 
you can either pamper yourself or that would be really good for a stocking stuffer or a gift for someone. And I have had things go in and out of the box. <laughs> I'll come in here and I'll sometimes grab things. Oh, that would work for so-and-so and I'll grab them and take them out. All right, so at, at different points there have been different things in this box, but this is where we're at now. Then in this little beauty space container, this came in the Walmart as like an elevated box. Normally they do their box once, um, once a quarter and it's $6.98, but they asked if I wanted the upgraded one for I think it was $14.98 plus tax. I said yes, that was great. Uh, really good products in there. You'll see one of them in just a minute. But this little bag is one of the things that came and it works just great for holding a few of the smaller items in this box. We have got a darling little... Um, a little bracelet that I believe came from my Enjoy box. That is a faith-based box. I loved that box. Get closer so you can see. Isn't that cute with the little stars? I think that's where that one came from. And then we have, this is just a little anklet. It's hard to see, but it's just a little chain anklet that came from, I think, Vacasi Shoes. It was a nice little touch to put in there. So I unboxed for them. I did a pair of sky-high heels. And then we've got this little um, necklace and earring set. This is faux jewelry. Uh, this came from a drape fit unboxing. Then in here we have Philip B. Peppermint Avocado Shampoo. It's a scalp invigorator and volumizing. Why didn't I keep this? I think this may have come from the Walmart. Uh, let me see if I can get it over there so you can see it. Giveaway two, but um, because I have the perm, I'm afraid to use it. I don't want it to do anything to damage my perm. I'm very careful about what I'm putting on my hair. And this came in the Walmart Beauty, and if I'm not mistaken, this was about a $70 value. This is Bare Lash Essential Serum. This helps with uh, lash growth and thickness. I already have long, thick lashes, so I just don't need it. So that is going to be coming to you. Someone look it up real quick and check the value on it but it was it way more than paid for the cost of the of the box i was stunned by what came in that walmart beauty box really great subscription boxes i've gotten uh, lately the ones that weren't so great i'll tell you about this is the item that i um and the reason i'm going ahead and doing this now i did want to celebrate one year uh, but also I was afraid, whoops, the little brush fell out, that this item, because it's not sealed, I was afraid that it would go bad. It is just a, I'll show you the top of it, I'm not going to take it out. It's a clay mask and it does have the, well, I will take it out. It does have this thing across the top and I've kept it closed except for when I opened it for the unboxing, but it's not actually sealed and I'm afraid that this um, could just dry out. So I want to get it sent. Um, I have plenty of masks, so I didn't keep it. This one came with the Ice Cream Beauty, which leads me to the second thing you need to do for this unboxing. That video came out on Monday. So if you would like to enter this giveaway, please go to that video and tell me something you either liked or didn't like about both of the boxes that I uh, unboxed there. It's a uh, Lips and Lather and Ice Cream Beauty. And I know this is a little bit tricky on my part, but that video, like I said, is doing badly. <laughs> so, and, and I think for the value in that box, that's not too much to ask. So, you know, like I said, like, comment, be subscribed, uh, comment down below why you want to win, and then go to that one and enter something, just tell me something you liked about each of those products so that I know you at least semi watch the video. Okay, next up we have a little sign. This came from, I think it came from the Introverted Chick box. If I'm not mistaken, do I have the pamphlet on it here? Yes, I have the pamphlet on it here. Um, this says, do more of what makes you happy. That's a really great box. It's just that I'm not really into tchotchkes too much. I guess I could use it on my tiered tray, but this isn't really my aesthetic. So it's just this little sign. Um, the introverted chick is it's made for introverts but i think really anybody would appreciate it some really cute tongue-in-cheek type things there's a few other items in here from that one okie dokie now what do we do oh this is just something i've had and we've not really used 
<laughs> and I think they're cute. It's a deck of cards from Skechers. Oh, there we go. We have so many cards. We love to play cards. Do you like to play cards? We play, uh, my favorite is spades. My, son's fa my husband's favorite is hand and foot. We have had some awesome spades and hand, hand and foot games with family. Uh, all of our kids, our adult kids, when they come to visit, they feel the same way about our house that I did about um, my grandparents' house and, the, and uh, holidays growing up. It wasn't complete if we didn't finish with playing cards. So this is the outside of the cards and then they're really cute, that sort of thing. Can you see? There we go. I keep looking off to the side so I can see what you guys are looking at on the on the cards themselves. They're adorable. Brand spanking new. We've just never had an opportunity to use these, so I'm going to just pass them off to one of my viewers. I must have ordered a pair of Skechers and they came with it, so I just thought I'd toss it in the box. I mean, you pay one price for shipping this. By the way, that also leads... I'm sorry, this has to go to somebody in with a U.S. address because... This is a U.S. priority mailbox. I'm sorry to my overseas people. I wish there was a way I could do for you guys too, but it's just, at this point, monetarily, we're not sitting in a spot where I can do something, you know, for both my overseas and my domestic winners. Okay, this came from the introverted chick also. This is Under the Stars coasters. There are two of them in here and they look like a galaxy. Aren't those pretty? They're very nice quality. They're kind of heavy. Um, I like them. They just don't match my aesthetic. And we have coasters out the yin yang. So those are going to go to one of my viewers. And then we have got the 17 feet of super long 50 soft glow LED lights. This also came from introverted chick. Let me double check on that. I'm almost positive I'm right on that. No, it did not come from Introverted Chick. This came from, did this come from the Enjoy Box? It may, yes, I think this came from the Enjoy Box, if I'm not mistaken. It's a faith-based box. And they're beautiful, I just don't know where I would put them here. Are they lighting up? They're lighting up. So that's coming, so if you have a cool place to put those, or if you have a teenager, those would probably be awesome. Little kid, you could string them across some shelves. This came from the introverted chick box. Lots of things from the introverted chick box. It says, oh, I'm sorry, did I just blow your mind? It's a postcard. Wow, that, <laughs> that uh, ring light is brutal. And I think it just got brighter. And uh, things just got super weird. It's my time to shine, another postcard. And then right here is a magnetic holder for either that or photos on your refrigerator. So that's kind of cute. The introverted chick is a box that's made for introverts. I think I may have already said that, didn't I? But I think it's fun for anybody. Next up is the Dawn Gazing Palette. This came out of the ice cream beauty box that I am telling you to go back and tell me something you either don't like or don't like about both of those, uh, those boxes. And this is an eyeshadow palette. And I have most of these colors and the colors that I don't have, I just wouldn't use, for instance, this very bright one down here. So that's a, that's a nice little eyeshadow palette. The value on this was $16, by the way. That box, uh, I kept everything except for this. That Ice Cream Beauty was really, really good. The value on it was outstanding. It was only 25 bucks and... Um, that's also where that mask came from. And that clay mask, by the way, I think that was a $40 mask. So that more than paid for the box right there. Yeah, my skinny mask. By the way, Ruger started out, that, I've already shown you that one, but that came from uh, Ice, Ice Cream Beauty too. And that was a $40 value. That's what I was getting at with that. Ruger was with us on the start. Uh, he, even though I gave him a couple of treats, he seemed to think that um, this... Uh, and everything coming out of here should be for him. He was looking for toys, so we sent him out. This is just a silly little thing, but this came from the Enjoy box, I think, too. It's just a little sucker. It's a little blueberry. If you have a child or a grandchild, I think they would really enjoy this. Okay. 
Also from the introverted chick box. Now remember, I said I don't do much with tchotchkes. I know you're going, she gave that whole box away. I kind of did. But it was fun to unbox and I understood completely why people would love it. And a lot of people liked this. So complete with batteries is this mercury glass lamp. Um, primitives by somebody, I can't see the name. But it's, you put the batteries in the lid and she actually included the batteries with it. And this will shine, you know, you could put it on a, on a shelf or something. I think this is a very pretty, very pretty piece. So that one is gonna be in the giveaway too. And I think this was like an $18 value on this little lamp. Oh, get it all folded up. That's me. I like everything buttoned up and finished. I guess I could do this later. Okay. Then we've got, remember I unboxed Proper Good? This is the one item in here I did not pay for. Um, they sent me, just they just wanted me to try it, and I told them I would do a video for them of um, their overnight oats. And so they sent me six packages of three different flavors, two each, and I can't eat this one because it is apple cinnamon and walnut. So there are two of these, come on camera, there we go, two of these in here, as well as the little shaker bottle. So it has the little pouch that comes with it. They sent all this to me for free. I thought that was really nice. And by the way, the ones I was able to eat, there was a blueberry maple and I'm trying to remember what the other uh, flavor was. They were really good. They're almost like a granola um, type texture until they get wet and you just add your um, your milk of choice uh, overnight um, but anyway there's the container and it goes in you might want to go on the website and I think it's I know what it is you put you put this in here and then you fill it up until it gets over top of the oats but in my case I did it until the oats had risen pretty good let them sit in your refrigerator overnight in the morning you can just eat them and yes they're cold um, I thought they were delicious, but I've been eating cold overnight oats for years. And, um, but the thing is you can heat them. I actually heated them up one day just to see how they were and they were delicious. And then I also included the little spoon. Look at the little container. Oh, for Pete's sake, camera, come on. And it's got this adorable little spoon in it. So there you go. You have a whole set and it says, says something in there. Happy spoon, happy you on the inside. So there you go. You got some oats overnight and you've got a spoon and you got a container to make it in. I saw two little items here in the bottom that I forgot were here. They're just little, uh, one is a magnet. Introvert shine from the inside out. Oh my goodness, there we go. And then this is a little purse mirror and it looks like a disco ball. So I figure out at the very end that I need to get real close to the camera from the beginning. So there's that. And I'm gonna put that inside this so all the little things don't bounce around in here and potentially break or anything like that. And the last item, and this is the most valuable item in the box and you guys are gonna think I'm crazy for not keeping this. But there's a reason. Um, I'm going to read to you what it is and I'm going to hold it up. This is the, there we go, there's what it is. It's a microdermabrasion skin rejuvenation kit. So Dermatech Microdermabrasion Kit is $129. This came from uh, the Naked Beauty box and they, she has discontinued that box and it's sad because it was fantastic. That was my favorite of all of the unboxings, the beauty unboxings I did was Naked Beauty. The value was out the roof. I think I paid $65 for the box. And I mean, this is, according to the retail price, twice the price of that, what I paid for the box. So um, 
The Dermatech Microdermabrasion Kit uses a popular treatment of microdermabrasion, exfoliation, and smooth suction technology to gently remove dead skin cells, cleanse pores, boost collagen production, and promote the growth of new healthy skin cells. The interchangeable suction heads allow for different uses, including massaging, exfoliating, stimulating, microcirculation, and extracting blackheads. So it sounds like something I should be using, but when I tried to use it, I felt like for me, the suction was too much. I used it for about two seconds. And then I took a um, Q-tip, dipped in rubbing alcohol. I cleaned all around the suction tip of the little head I was using and I let it air dry real good. And then I packaged it back in here. So I did use it for, I'm not kidding, maybe two seconds. I was like, I don't like this. It's not the right thing for me. I'm sure someone else would absolutely love it. Again, with my sensitive skin, and I actually exfoliate in the shower every night. I've got an exfoliating mitt and exfoliating cloth. So for me, that's working great. Um, but I just thought I would go ahead and pass this on to one of my viewers. So there you go. I don't know, that might make a good gift for you too. There we are. That is my giveaway for the one year marking of the one year anniversary of our channel. Thank you very much to everyone who has been here with me through this whole process, who has commented, liked, subscribed, encouraged me. Thank you so much. Uh, you guys have been the biggest blessing and I wouldn't have kept going with this for a full year if it weren't for my viewers, quite frankly. You guys are awesome and I, I love you and I love being able to do nice things like this. So. Um, again, you know the rules, comment down below. I know I'm repeating, but, uh, with why you would like to win, then go to the video. I will link the video. I'll try to remember after this gets out to put it in the, to pin it to the top of the comments. And, um, that way you can go straight to that video and tell me what you liked or didn't like about both of the products that I unboxed. It's the ice cream beauty and, uh, lips and lather box in that box. And if you wouldn't mind taking a look at the linked videos down below about the products that are the boxes that contain these products, that would help me out an awful lot. Okay, I have taken up enough of your time. Good luck to you and thank you so much for watching this. Again, thank you for um, being such great subscribers and we will see you on the next video tomorrow, I believe, with another clothing unboxing. Bye bye and be blessed. Hey guys, this is an un impromptu. I can get the words right.